Hey, yo guys, it's Slaro. You already know that today I'm bringing you another installment of this Showdown Shenanigans uh, thing series that I'm doing. So, yes, what we are doing uh, today is, of course, having some shenanigans on Showdown. Uh, I had to organize this together because I've wanted to do this for a really long time, actually. So basically what we're doing is we have made two teams. I'm going to show them off uh, one at a time. Uh, that consists of six Pokemon that are capable of Mega Evolving. Um, but only one, of course, is the Mega. And I had my opponent do the same thing. Today we're going to be battling Shadow Gaming Hub, uh, my really good friend Colton. Um, his links will be in the description below, even though he doesn't upload very often until he gets back to his computer and all that. You should still check him out and still do all the good, nice stuff to him. That is going to go to weird places, but let's not worry about that. So basically the idea is uh, no Ubers, uh, no Pokemon whose Mega Evolution is Ubers, and they're not, so no Gengars, no Kangaskhan, no Latios, Latios, things like that. We can't have that. Um, and it's basically what I like to call this is a Guess My Mega battle, because you have to figure out which one is the Mega. So let's actually go into what my team consists of. Um, and I kind of want to go backwards. I'm going to go backwards on this one, and you'll see why. Um, so, obviously, as you saw, the Heracross is my Mega for this team, uh, which is pretty interesting when you consider the other Pokemon here. Um, so, what I'm bringing today is going to be uh, Sableye with Leftovers for Cover Willowis, Foul Play, Knockoff, Physically Defensive, pretty standard. Um, needed a defensive wall because this team does not have much defense to it at all. Um, so, I'm probably going to get bodied, but whatever. I think my second team is better, but I like my, I like my second team better, but I want to use that second just because I'd rather end off on a good note. Um, then I'm bringing a Choice Banded Metacham with Drain Punch, Zen Headbutt, High Jump Kick, and Ice Punch, Jolly Nature, Max Attack, Max Speed, blah blah blah, so I can outspeed some things, have a fast, uh, hard hitting physical attacker. Uh, then we're going to go with the Life Orb, Magic Guard, Alakazam, Dazzling Gleam, Energy Ball, Psy Shock, Shadow Ball, of course, and this is a uh, Timid Nature. Max Special Attack, Max Speed. Of course, there's nothing too fancy yet. Um, <clears throat> this first team isn't full of too many sh different shenanigans um, until the end, but I don't know. I don't know. I, I wanted to throw a team together that, <laughs> you know, could possibly work. Um, so then I'm bringing Assault Vest Blastoise with Scald, Rapid Spin, Mirror Coat, and Aura Sphere because why not? Max uh, HP, Max Special Attack, basically. Uh, modest nature, so that's going to be a bulky special attacker that can take special hits because I don't have a special wall um, But it is what it is then uh, and rapid spin is important because low punny is being brought with the focus sash um, Did I want limber? Yeah, I think I wanted limber so that way it can't be paralyzed. Yeah, that's what I wanted um, With agility baton pass thunder wave and healing wish uh, not a single attacking move focus sash max speed timid nature max HP um, because I want to get an Agility Baton Pass off into my Mega Heracross. That way, <clears throat> Mega Heracross can just sweep his entire team. That's the goal. That's why rocks can't be up on the field. Um, if something happens and I'm not able to do that, I can Thunder Wave, uh, you know, opposing maybe Scarfers or whatever. I can Healing Wish into something. Who knows? Uh, Low Punny is just being brought for shenanigans uh, because that's what we do. This is Slyro's showdown shenanigans, and that's what we're here to cause. Um, so then, of course, Heracross here, the Mega Heracross, um, hopefully can get a, a baton pass into it. I think I'm going to make this thing adamant because the idea is for it to get a agility baton pass into it. So I shouldn't need to be worrying about speed. It is max attack, max speed. Has some decent natural bulk. Whatever, Bullet Seed, Rock Blast, Pin Missile, Knock Off. Um, so that is fun. So let's take this first team against Cole, and I'm going to send him the challenge right now <clears throat> uh, to this OU battle. So let's go ahead. OU, guess my Mega 1. Bam. So we're going to challenge him and see what he's bringing, and he's going to have to guess our Mega. We're going to have to guess his Mega. It's going to be great. Now, I have talked to him, and he has told me that his team is quote-unquote cancer um and the very minute that i heard that i was like mega slowbro so this is probably mega slowbro however um it could be mega audino i don't know could even be mega sableye actually um but i think it's going to be mega slowbro either way let's treat this like a regular battle as far as what we are going to do i'm really excited i love battling so much um let's see i think 
Sableye could lead off. It could be Steelix. Can we just go Sableye for Sableye lead? I think my Sableye lead is the best. Okay, great, great, great. Uh, because he cannot really switch into a Will-O-Wisp unless he has Heal Bell on his Audino. So I'm going to go ahead and Will-O-Wisp. Okay, that's exactly what he does. I can also probably get rid of... Uh, there's no leftovers. Let's find out. Let's find out. I could have a fairy move. Okay, I, left, I did knock off his leftovers. And he toxics me. I do not have a, a heal bell or, or anything like that. Um, what I think I'm going to do now is I'll probably just go into Alakazam. Because if he wants to go for a toxic, he can. Yeah, I'm going to do that. Dazzling Gleam. Okay. Perfect, perfect. So that switch works just as well. Uh, I could Shadow Ball, predicting him to switch out. Uh, what hits most of his team? Dazzling Gleam, maybe. Psy Shock hits everything except for Sableye. But I don't think he'd bring Sableye in. Uh, Psy Shock doesn't really hit Metagross very well. Uh, Shadow Ball is so good, though. I'm going to go for Energy Ball. Okay, that works. That did a decent amount, actually. Uh, another one's not going to take him out, though. We could go into... We could go back into Sableye. No, he's going to have a fairy move. That would be stupid. Wow, my team is so weak to fairy. My team is so weak to fairy. I could go into Blastoise. That might be the best thing to do here. But I don't really have recovery. Let's see, the energy ball did that much. Psy shock. I'm gonna go for another energy ball. Okay, he does live. What is he gonna go for? Moonblast. Alright, I can still live it. That's great, that's great, that's great, that's great. Um, so he could predict the energy ball. Nothing really wants to take it though. Nothing really wants to take it. I'm gonna go for a shadow ball. There it is. I was expecting Metagross to potentially come in. Look at that! Ooh, that's so good. But he's probably gonna go for bullet punch, so in comes Sableye. Yep. Ooh, this is a decent amount. Um, I could probably knock off. Or I could recover. I'm gonna knock off. Mmm. That's right, Audino gets Regenerator. I... Forgot about that. What is stopping Heracross's sweep? Steelix. Steelix is 100% stopping me from sweeping. I'm going to go into Blastoise. I know he can Toxic. But I feel like he has to Dazzling Gleam. Which he does. He's easily going to be able to tell that I'm a Soul Vest. He's also going to switch out. But nothing really wants to take a Scald. So I'm going to do that. Let's do this. Ugh, Colton's such a good battler. Okay, this is where problems start happening. I could go into Mega Heracross now. What if he scalds? Hmm. This has to be Mega Slowbro. I just know it is. Just from the way he was talking. I could go into Low Punny and try. No, but there's no point. If I'm going to go against the Slowbro, I should go into Heracross now. I think I have to go into Sableye. I think I have to go into Sableye. Uh, because, I mean, I could go for Scald Burns, I guess. I feel like he's going to set up a Calm Mind. I feel like he's going to set up a Calm Mind. And I can... Oh, I don't know. There it is. He goes for Earthquake. What? I'm going to go for the Recover. Okay. And there's the Audino. Now, I can switch into something and take a Dazzling Gleam again. Or he could try and double switch. And I can go for a Foul Play or a Will-O-Wisp. It's really tempting. It's really tempting. I might regret this. YOLO. Oh, he stayed in! No! Oh, I survived. Okay, JK. Sweet, so now he has to switch out, and I get a free recover off. He has to switch out if he wants to keep this Audino, otherwise it dies. Alright, so he goes into his own Sableye. Um, I could see a will o -Wisp coming. I could see a knockoff coming. Uh, I could see a lot of things coming. However... Blastoise is probably the best to take him on. 
If I was really real, I could go into Alakazam. I don't think I'm that real. I think I need a free switch. I, need, I think I need a clean switch into it. I can't switch it on Sableye in case he knocks off. There it is. There goes my Assault Vest. That's actually a big problem. That is a big problem. I'm going to go for the Scald. He's going to... Oh, he misses the burn. That's so good for us. And we get the burn. Okay, this is so good. This is so good. This is so good. Scald again. I knew he was going to go for a will Why didn't I switch into... Alakazam. I think I'm going to switch into Alakazam now because he has to recover. He has to recover. Or he withdraws. Either one works. And Audino is not going to live a Psy Shock. That's just not happening. Okay, Diancy for the fodder. That's great. Uh, so he's probably going to send out Metagross again to get the bullet punch or to scare me with the bullet punch. Or he goes into Steelix. Okay. Mm, what is he going to go for? I think Save Black can live something. I can scare him out with the Will O Wisp. Oh, I don't live that. I don't live that at all. Bullet C is not going to do enough. I'm going to go into Medicham. I think I'm free to go for an Ice Punch. Sableye, Sableye is immune to both my stabs. I think Ice Punch is a choice banded Ice Punch. That doesn't do nearly enough. A crit? Are you kidding me? Alright, we have to go for broke here. We have to go for broke. Here's what's gonna happen. Alakazam is gonna come in here and get off a Shadow Ball. That's just how it has to work. If I can get the Steelix low enough health, I can sweep his team with Heracross. And a special defense fail, it doesn't matter. Alright, so here's 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 what we're gonna do. Here's Low Pony. This thing has to be, this one thing might be Choice Banded. Agility. I'm Sash. Alright, so he got rid of the Steelix himself. I didn't need to worry about it. No! <sighs> he's gonna bring in Metagross. No, he's not. Why wouldn't you do that? Oh, he might burn me and then I'll baton pass that on. Really? Does that work? I don't know, let's find out. Do you pass on statuses? We're gonna find out. I don't actually know if you pass on statuses or not. I feel like you don't. Yeah, you don't. Uh, I think I still have to try. I know he can burn me, but... <sighs> this is my shot. This is my shot, I'm gonna have to go for it. I know he's gonna burn me. Maybe he'll miss. No, he recovers. Oh my goodness, that's so good. Oh my goodness, that's so good. Alright, so now we're at plus two speed. We outspeed his team. Did we get the Mega Hair Cross Sweep? Did we do it? Did we do it? Pin missile. Yeah, you don't. Yeah, you're just normal. Mega Audino. Yeah, so this is stab. Two. Skill link. Come through. Ooh, we're gonna get the Mega Heracross sweep. Yes! Oh my goodness. I cannot believe this is gonna work out. Get wrecked! Oh, the Mega Heracross sweep comes through. Critical hit. Doesn't matter. Come in with your Mega Slow Bro. Please die to one pin missile. Do it. Do it. Oh my goodness, it will. Yes, we got the Mega. <laughs> Yes, we got the Mega Heracross sweep. The, the agility baton pass from Low Punny into the Mega Heracross worked out. I cannot believe that worked. Holy crap. All right, and now we're going to do a second battle to see if he can get some revenge. And because I made another really fun team. All right, so here's my other team. Uh, I think similar thing, we're going to go from right to left because that's just how this is going to be. Um, so first up, I needed some fast mods. I'm just going to be straight up. This is a trick room team and I've never successfully made a trick room team. So let's show off this team really quick. Uh, we have Garchomp holding an expert belt with rough skin, stealth rock, earthquake, stone edge, and outrage. Uh, max attack, max beat jolly. I wanted to, I didn't want to be choiced into anything, um, but I still wanted power and I didn't really want to use life orb. So expert belt it is. Why not? Uh, it's fun. 
I've never actually tried Expert Belt Garchomp. I don't know if it's really viable, but this is a 1v1 match, so uh, again, there is a little bit of planning, uh, more so than just kind of taking viable stuff. Obviously, because I'm bringing Assault Vest Sceptile. Why? Because, why not? Power Punch, Drain Punch, Leaf Blade, and Earthquake. Um, max Attack, Max Speed. Uh, these are my two very fast mons, um, because in case Trick Room doesn't work, I still want to be able to outspeed his things. Um, and then we have Scizor, which is going to be Life Orb, Technician Scizor, Bullet Punch, Roost, U-Turn, Bug Bite, Brave Nature, Max HP, Max Attack. That way I get, and Zero Speed IVs, that way it can outspeed um, and hit things like Bug Bite and U-Turn in a Trick Room. Um, and of course says Bullet Punch for when it's not Trick Room, or even when it is, it still gets priority, and Roost... Um, you know is also really good um so that could work in trick room that's not the main trick room sweeper or anything like that now we get into one of the trick room setters which is going to be slow bro which has leftovers and regenerator max attack or i'm sorry max hp uh max defense this should actually technically be 248 and we'll make this a uh Sci-Shock skull to slack off trick room um yeah, that's one of the Trick Room setters. The other Trick Room is going to be Diancie, also holding the leftovers. There's no item clauses that we agreed to, so uh, double leftovers. This has Trick Room, Heal Bell, uh, Moon Blast, and Diamond Storm. That way, I don't know, Scissor gets burned, whatever, I don't know. It works out. Specially Defensive, so I have Physically Defensive Slowbro, Specially Defensive Diancie. Both are Trick Room setters. Those are my two main uh, defensive switch-ins. And then the Trick Room Sweeper is going to be the Mega Camera up to with Flamethrower, Earth Power, Flash Cannon, and Substitute because I didn't really need a fourth coverage move that I could tell. Max HP, Max Special Attack, Quiet Nature to, uh, oh, and I should put zero IVs in speed as well. Um, these ones, it doesn't matter as much. Oh, I do have zero IVs in speed for them as well. So let's try out this Trick Room team, see if we can get a successful Trick Room off because I've never actually done so. So. Let's go ahead and bring the second team in. Alright, I see Obama Snow. That really raises a red flag. It could be Mega Obama Snow. There could be a Mega Charizard there. Uh, I do see Bennett. Could be Mega Bennett. Or it could be Mega Glalie. I don't really think the Blastoise is. I really don't think the Garchomp is. A part of me really wants to say that the Charizard isn't either. Um, but either way, now it's time to think about what his leads could be. I guess it could be Garchomp. I don't see why it wouldn't be Garchomp. Uh, we can do Garchomp v Garchomp. I do have Outrage on this thing. That would be really funny to use right away. Uh, but he has a Glalie, so that's not an option until that thing is dead. Uh, that is my ice coverage. I could go into Slowbro. I can live anything from Garchomp. Uh, he could also start off with Obama Snow. But I really don't want to start off with Camera Up. I think I'm going to start off with Slowbro. He does start off with Obama Snow. Okay. Um, this thing cannot one-shot me. It's an Obama Snow. It, there's no way. I'm going to go for a Trick Room. Oh, okay, 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 okay. He also did not Mega Evolve. Can we break his Sash? Or not his Sash, his Substitute. That does a lot. That does a lot. That was a crit. Alright, we get the Regenerator. We're just going to have to save this thing and go into Scizor, which can... Oh, Focus Punch, no! No, he got a sub-Focus Punch off! Okay, did less than half. Not a big deal, actually. Um, we could go for a U-turn. That's not really worth it. I can go for a Bug Bite. Oh, snap. Does he automatically get it off? Oh. I thought I got another chance to do something. That really sucks. Uh, Trick Room is up. Dang it, dang it, dang it. I thought I got another another chance. I could have roosted there if I knew that, but oh well. That's my mistake. Uh, we can go straight for the flamethrower, or we can go for our own substitute. Let's go for our own substitute. Okay, he's going to go into Blastoise. Um, so we do get... Uh, Alright, so we're going to go second now, but we can get a free hit off, and I think that's going to be an Earth Power for us. It's going to break the sub. I, I love substitutes. I don't know why I've, I never used them that much before. They are they are a really good thing. I could go back into Slowbro. Slowbro doesn't have the special defense. Uh, Diancie does. I also have the Assault Vest Sceptile. But if he burns me with the Scald, that's a problem. 
He's probably going to predict me to switch. I'm going to go into Slowbro. I don't think he has anything that can take me out, even though it is special attacking. Yeah, Scald cannot take me out. And... I could switch out again. Predicting something. Predicting... I don't know what. But I just want to get some regenerator health. If he goes for Scald again, that's a problem. That's a problem. I have Heal Bell, actually. I'm going to go into Sceptile. If he gets a burn, I just go into Diancy. Alright. He got a burn. I'm going into Diancy. Diancy is my special wall. Um, it can take Scalds for days. Uh, can it take on a Bomb of Snow for days? Probably. Well, it does have really good physical defense. Uh, but he gets sub focus punch again. I'm gonna diamond storm. Oh, we just trail. What? That's not okay. All right, so Sceptile is now useless. All right, well I can outspeed. He could have ice shard. Hmm. Camera up could. Oh wait, I didn't get the Trick Room up yet. I mean, I'm gonna outspeed. I don't think an Ice Shard will take me out. If it does, whatever. Sceptile is useless anyway at this point. I'm going to go for the Drain Punch. Okay, it does not take me out. I take out the Obama Snow. The Obama Snow was a way bigger problem than I thought it would be. Holy crap. Way bigger problem. I cannot believe... Dude, what the heck was it? It kept getting crits on the wood hammer. I, is wood hammer one of those moves that has a high critical hit chance? It might be actually. Uh, I'm gonna drain punch the Glalie. If he doesn't go for ice shard, okay, he did. It is what it is. That's fine. Um, so that means he's probably physical, which means I should slack off if he explodes. Can I live an explosion? Yeah, yeah, because it'll turn to ice type. Okay. Uh, I don't really know what he plans to do. I'm going to Psy Shock. He can try and get a burn, but Regenerator keeps getting my health back, and he has no reliable recovery. I mean, I can go for Scalds on him too, actually. I'm gonna go for Scalds. We'll just try and trade off. Burns will hurt him more than it'll hurt me. Hmm, hmm, hmm. What, can we get a burn? We are not getting a burn. Alright, I'm gonna slack off this turn. He might predict this and switch out into something. Because he didn't make a move right away. That's making me think that that's what it is. If we take this, well, like, I take one game, he takes this game, then uh, we don't have a, a tiebreaker game, but I do have... There is, there is um, another thing that I want to do with Colton on the Showdown Shenanigans series that uh, he, even he doesn't know about yet. Um, so, <laughs> but he just scalds. And uh, yeah, maybe we'll use that as our little uh, tiebreaker. Because I don't think I'm going to win this one. No, I'm going to go for a scald now. Again, burns hurt him more than they hurt me. We're not getting a burn. We are not getting a burn. Can we burn? We are not getting it. Holy crap. Alright, I have to slack off. And then I think... Now let me scald it one more time. I want to get the burn. Please. We have to get the burn this time. Are you kidding me? Alright, I'm going to have to slack off again. I think he's foddering this thing off, but it's just taking a long time for him to do so I don't know why he would fodder this thing off though it clearly is hard for me to take out Ro what okay so now I'm back up to full health for free eventually I'm scalding him I'm sorry I mean I'm burning him yeah. What the heck? What the actual heck? I'm gonna go for a trick room. 
So now I can heal up before he can attack me. And now he can't roar me out. If he roars me out in a camera, then I outspeed and I can probably take him out with something. All this comes down to is I need a burn. Thank you! Oh my goodness, that took literally forever. So now I slack off. The burn is going to start taking him down. I really want to be able to stay around long enough to set up another trick room. If we're being honest. This is such a stally battle. But at least we're not taking like forever. Whatever, I'm just going to slack off again. And now I, now I can attack him. And he doesn't want to switch anything into a Scald. Ooh, Trick Room. I have to set up the Trick Room. Because nothing on his team is slower than me. And he's already shown the Mega Glalie, actually. I didn't even take notice of that. So now, the Spinette can't really do anything to me? If I burn this, it's a problem. Ooh, okay. That did 24%. Okay, hopefully that wasn't like a low roll. Hopefully I can live another one. Okay. Gunk shot. Okay. I'm gonna slack off again. Ooh, sucker punch. Okay. Okay, 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 okay. Slowbro might be able to stall out his whole team. That's not really what I wanted to come down to. Ooh. Let's see. Oh, I burned him. Oh, all right, this is perfect. So now I set up another trick room, and I think I'm going to play it risky, and I think I might go into camera up after I do that. Let's do it. All right, so now I switch out into camera up. And now I outspeed, and I go for the flamethrower. All right, there we go. This is fantastic. Now there's the Charizard. Uh, I think I can just go for Flash Cannon. Oh, that does nothing. Dig? Nope. Good thing he didn't have a Power Herb. Holy crap. All right, I have to go back in the slow row uh, because now I can I can Scald. And he has to stay in now that he went for dig. That's about half. I hope he doesn't dig again. No, now he goes for rock slide. So this is a dead Charizard. Look at Slowbro. <laughs> I thought Mega Slowbro was going to be a problem and it wasn't. And now look at regular Slowbro bro being the problem. I think I'm going to slack off. Dragon Rush. Okay, that was a crit too. Holy crap. That's not okay. That did a lot. Ooh, that was a crit though. So I should be able to live another. Alright, I think I might have to trick room. Let's trick room. And now... <laughs> I can slack off again. I might be... No, I'm not going to be risky. I can't, I can't be that risky. Actually, yes I can. Let's do it. I'm going to scald. Oh, now he's going to Home Claws. Alright, I need... I, I want to Scald. I actually want to Scald. I just want to see if this works. I want, I want to be kind of risky. Alright, so now Trick Room is still up. Uh, and I don't think he resists... Earth Power? Does he? Nope, that takes him out. Alright, cool. We're getting this... Almost, uh, it didn't... The Trick Room kind of worked, but it kind of didn't. Oh, am I going to die to an Ice Shard? Do I die to an Ice Shard? I I'm going to uh, Stone Edge is actually probably the better play. I kind of want to go for Outrage just to be fun. I forget which one's super effective against Ice. That's such a bad thing to forget. I'm going to go I'm going to go for Outrage. I feel like even with same type attack bonus, or I feel like even, I don't know, I'm going to go for Outrage. Oh, it doesn't take him out. Dang it. No! Oh, is that a tie? I won the battle! Yeah! I guess technically I win because it says I won, so we're going to go with that. Uh, <laughs> like I said, 
Nah, it says I won. Nah. Either way, those battles were fun. I really liked the Guess My Mega idea. Um, if you guys did enjoy this idea, make sure you let me know. Also, if you have any ideas for other shenanigans that I can pull on Showdown, please let me know in the comment section below. Stay tuned for uh, more videos in the future of this nature. And I think that's about it. Make sure you go check out Colton and his channel and all that other stuff. You're probably going to see him around a lot more in the future. So that is a thing. I'm going to go ahead and get up out of here, wrap this up, because I have no idea how long this video has been. Probably longer than I was anticipating. Either way, thanks for thank you guys for watching. And until the next time, stay sly.